What's up guys? Today we are going to be playing some more PlayStation VR and I'm actually super super excited to check out this game. So it's called I Expect You to Die and basically you're a secret agent who gets put in unfortunate situation. So like you're stuck in a locked car with an explosive that's about to go off. So you have to figure out how to defuse the explosive and get out of the car and all kinds of stuff like that. It looks insane. It looks like it's going to be a ton of fun and it's something where you have to act quickly and think quickly in order to survive. So uh, I think it's going to be good. I hope that you guys enjoy. Let's go ahead and get started. Whoa. Welcome to the Enhanced Operative Division. I am your assigned handler and support agent. We're going to be fast friends, I have no doubt. Your new implants allow you to use telekinetic abilities to manipulate the world around you. Back when I was a field agent, we had to pick things up the old-fashioned way. Fumbling for it after our third martini. I find testing your spine to be an absolute joy, don't you? Try leaning left. Oh, we're knocking the books over. That's sick. All right, anyway, let's focus here, guys. Here we go. Secret agent with our secret agent hands. About a smack that is. All right, to the left, to the right. Now that we're finished with calisthenics, let's move on to dexterity. The current slide illustrates how to activate switches. Shall we? Your ability to push buttons is beyond reproach, agent. But what about your ability to pick things up? Fortunately, as the current slide shows, that I don't normally condone Good the use of fire indoors. But what the hell? Pick up the lighter on your left, then press the move button to light it. The move button is the Excellent. Got him! Let's practice aiming with your new telekinetic powers. Pressing the move button will activate them. The circle that appears is where you're aiming. If it turns blue, you can pick up the object in the same manner that you grab objects nearby. Pick up what we've just sent you through the door. Okay. So, oh, through here. Nice. We got now it! that you have the target, you can move it closer or further away using the small buttons towards the outside of the controller. Drive okay. the target closer to your desk. Whoa, that's pretty cool. You're a natural. While still holding the target, move your thumb to press the hover button shown on the slide. The target will hover in the air. Try hovering the target over the fake plant to your left. Oh, okay. So we want to we want to sit it out away from us. And then hover it. Well done. I wish we could afford real plants, but our dry martini budget is disproportionate to well, everything else. Now, try to hover a Excellent work. Got it. Let's try one more if you're feeling frisky. Hover the third target over the round table to your right. Well placed. Now, there's only one thing we do. Great. Only one target. Opening drawers and compartments will be instrumental in navigating the various desks you may encounter on your dangerous missions. Excellent. I'll unlock the training slide reel from the projector after you retrieve your new mission from the door. Okay. Pick this up. Bring it to well us. Feel free. I don't need this thing. Oh, dang it. Can you throw stuff up and shoot it? Oh, we got it. Let's go. That's actually pretty cool. Okay, so Operation Friendly Skies is up next. We're calling this mission Operation Friendly Skies. I hope you like cars and airplanes and cars in airplanes. Don't I can deal with that. Corporate billionaire by day, underhanded villain by night, has a cargo plane scheduled to depart for Zanzibar this very evening. We need you to infiltrate the plane before it takes off, gain access to the vehicle held within, and drive it right off the airplane. Our intel assures us Zor's car is equipped to handle a fall from any height, so we're almost positive you won't die. <laughs> okay. Press Sounds good to me. To begin your mission. Got it! Let's go, boys! So we're going to be infiltrating an airplane, stealing this guy's car, and driving it out. Whoa. There's cash back here. You may be wondering why this car can never reach Zanzibar. 
It has some of the most high-tech weaponry in Dr. Zor's considerable arsenal. Naturally, we'd like to poke at it a bit. Drive it off the plane, and you may just earn that vacation you're always going on about. Okay, this is crazy. There's cash back here, too. So we have money. We need to put everything up with us, because I know stuff is going to go bad. How to arm your bomb. Okay. Faulty cannon reset system. We would have to unscrew that. Okay. So I think if we unscrew this section right there, we're going to be able to turn off the cannon if the cannon comes out. What's this up here? Auto deploy parachute included. So I don't, I don't think we're gonna need that, but we can put that over there. Um, we have a gun. Oh gosh, sorry, didn't mean to do that. And we have some more cash. Just 10K stacks, 10 racks, boys. Um, make sure there's nothing there. Oh, oh, okay. We've got a key. That's probably gonna be important. Not even sure what that thing is. Is that everything we have? Oh, I think we might. Hold on. Aha! Homie's got some champagne in his seat or in his center console. Smoke? Are those. Okay, so we have smokes, we have more cash. You know, champagne glasses. That piece doesn't open. What about... Aha. What is this? A knife. We've got a knife. Homie just says stacks of cash everywhere. I don't know if we're going to need all this, but... I feel like we should have it just in case. I'm trying to keep things organized. So like I said, I don't think we're going to need this. So I'm going to put that down there because I feel like that's just taking up space. I know that this is going to be important. So this is saying in that thing, you have to undo the four screws, push the top red button, and you can put smoke. Maybe you put those smoke canisters in. I don't know. I'm not sure. So we're going to save that. We'll just put that there. This, it says how to arm your bomb. So one is green, two is blue, three is yellow. So if we're disarming it, assume it'd be backwards. I'm not sure, but we're gonna go ahead and put this in. It's on. Okay. Intruder detected. Present I for retina scan. Oh, this is a retina scanner. Oh shit! Oh, the old ticking bomb. I'm partial to plastic explosives myself, but you must respect the classics. I believe diffusing bombs is covered in basic training, yes? Okay, so three, two, no we got it! Is good ticking, as they say. Now, can we please focus on getting the car out of the plane? Oh! Oh. <laughs> We're good. We're good. Okay, we have a screwdriver here. Dude, this is sick. Master reset. Wait, can we just drive it? Honestly, Agent, we want the car in one piece. Nothing short of an explosion is going to make a dent in that cargo door. Oh. There's nothing back here we care about either. Is there anything over there? 
I'm not seeing anything. Okay. Um, I mean, I don't really know what to do here. I guess. Press the middle button and then the top button. System resetting. Deploying scorpions. Did you say scorpions? I certainly hope you did not just say scorpions. Oh shit! Whoa! I've got an idea. <laughs> what a rep, boys! A bit unconventional, but then again, convention never was your strong suit. You'd better drive the car off the plane before something else explodes. A little early to celebrate, don't you think? Heck yeah! Woo! Champagne showers, baby! Shake it up! Shake it up! Alright, it's time to go. Uh, put this thing in drive. Woo! Let's go, boys! We did it! Parachutes deployed. I think... Nice! Mission complete! Let's go, dude! That was sick! Mission. Now, about that vacation. I'm afraid I lied about that. But I believe hard work is its own reward, don't you? Nice! That was actually really good. I'm gonna chalk that up. That was a win because we prepared so well. We had everything laid out. We knew exactly what we had to do.